defense. Go, go, go. Nice pass. You're late. I had a minor work issue. Come on. Hey, sweetie. Guy at work said he'd pay $500 for this. If you keep pushing her, she's just gonna dig in harder. You gotta have a light touch. Christ, Wade! My grandmother could see that was a failure to advance, and she has bought LASIK surgery! Shh! Rhonda, I beg you, for your own good, do not shush this woman. Oh, she should shush herself. That blouse is louder than I could ever be. But seriously, honey, don't sweat this Maya stuff. Yeah. Look at Jimmy. Good grades, champion, powwow dancer, lacrosse king. He's like Captain Minishank out there. Meanwhile, Maya gives away her beadwork for free. She's my daughter, and I would take a bullet for her. But honestly, babe, I think she may be a dud. She had the nerve to call me weird. I'm the least weird dad. Rick LeClaire, he roller skates to work. Uh, I just think if we give her enough space. That's breaking! So help me wait. I am in heels, but I will run across this field and choke you! I'm just happy the kids have time for their culture and the community. Isn't that the whole goal? Yeah. But how's she gonna make her way in the world? You know, when I was Maya's age, my folks always told me, you'll never be Buffy St. Marie. And I wasn't. But I was Miss Indian World. How does that relate? It doesn't. I just wanted to remind you you married up. I'm cool, right? Cooler than Billy Jack. That's how you do it. We're headed to the grocery. Get some of that fancy bologna you like. <laughs> it's mortadella. And thank you. And uh, your friend Benny's lacrosse stick's looking ragged. Buy a new one. But tell him it's an extra you had from home. Thanks, Dad. You can keep the change, though, right? <laughs> I know. And Maya? You come with me. I have a proposition. I pay you to make 20 pieces of beadwork. Five are yours to do with what you will. I would give them away. And the rest, I sell for you. Unless... You want to learn from your old man? Maybe start a company together? I have some logo ideas. No. OK. I sell them. Two thirds of the profits go to your college fund, and the rest is yours to spend. Deal? Counter offer. How about I have no interest in starting a business. I make 20 pieces, and I keep 20 pieces. Fine. Then no more allowance. Fine. And no more going to the Elder's Lodge to bead with Grandma. Are you serious? No, of course not. That would be mean. She's a very old woman. Why are you so obsessed with money? Is everything like a deal to you? Oh, good. The truck started because I put gas in it, which costs money. Because literally everything costs money. Then why am I even in school? I should just quit and get a job at a sweatshop. Maya, please. You could never keep up with those kids. 